pressure was great today. Uh, I was nervous all day. I didn't play my best golf, but I think the experience of Portugal at the end of the season last year kind of helped me because that was real pressure. You know, playing for your life, you know, playing to stay out on the European tour, you know, playing to be able to pay the bills back home and, and everything. And I managed to squeeze in through the back door. Uh, third, third tournament <coughs> down the line, I've managed to win, and I think that just proves and shows that I deserve to be out here. And obviously, I'm relieved and really pleased with everything that's happened since then. When you win the British Amateur, everybody just expects you to be the next big best thing. Uh, you know, and I played in the Masters and we got a lot of coverage, and everybody just thought, oh, you know, he's British Amateur champion, he should do work really, really well. When you turn pro, you know, and I got my card at the first time of asking at the tour school. Uh, I lost my card straight away. It's really difficult transition, I'll be honest with you. Uh, but and then I had a couple of real poor years, and then in 2004 made the breakthrough, won a couple of times on the challenge tour. So I went back to uh, the beginning really, and worked really, really hard, and the support of a good family behind me and what I did is, is, is key really. And, uh, it hadn't been for my father-in-law and uh, a friend of his who gave me ten thousand pounds to play the Euro Pro in 2003, and maybe he wouldn't be sad to see my kids uh, celebrating. Uh, we'll see where it is. I honestly don't know where I am. I'm playing out with that next week, so that's the start.